So what is a nature preschool? A nature preschool is really, we cover all the same things as a usual preschool would, but we do it outdoors. So we're doing story times, we're sitting on a circle of stumps and reading a book, we're singing songs, we're counting the bugs or the flowers that we see along the trail. We're practicing our alphabet and writing our names. We might find sticks and make our names out of sticks. So we're hitting all of the same developmental standards as we would in a classroom, but we're doing those things outside. So a day at nature preschool typically looks like the kids arrive. Some of them arrive on a bus. Some of them arrive by parent pickup or drop off. And we'll come in, we have a circle time where we welcome everybody to school, go over our day, have some free play in the classroom, and then we have breakfast. Right after breakfast, we head outside. We spend about three hours outside every morning, so usually from nine until noon. And during that time, we're hiking on the trails, exploring all that Eagle Bluff has to offer, we will do a circle time outside, which includes songs and stories. And then oftentimes we also have a game or activity. After that time, we come back into the classroom for lunch and rest. Then we have a snack and the kids get back on the bus and head home for the day. Some of the differences between a standard preschool and a nature preschool are we spend most of our time outside. And one of the biggest things we notice is how much that affects the children's behaviors. So when we're inside, we might see a lot of challenging behaviors, struggles sharing toys, sharing space, sharing materials. And when we get outside, we really see a drastic reduction in all of that. Um, kids and teachers feel calmer, more able to meet the moment and there's just so many more opportunities for us to use our bodies to get our energy out and so a lot of those difficulties that we see inside a classroom once we're outside we just don't have to worry so much about those and it leaves so much space to really follow the children's curiosities and take um, take advantage of those teachable moments do you like playing inside or outside outside and inside Briar, do you like playing inside or outside? Inside and outside. What's your favorite thing to do outside? Uh, play in the sandbox. When I'm outside, I feel... Happy! When I'm happy and I am when I'm in the forest. So we've known for a really long time that early childhood education is something that we, like Eagle Bluff, feels really called to do. We have this amazing campus that's nestled in the middle of all these small towns here in southeast Minnesota and as far as we know there isn't a formal uh, nature preschool in this area and so based on the fact that environmental education is already something that we do and we do so well it was just natural to think about like well how can we enhance what we're doing but bring in um, early childhood experts and that's where the partnership between Head Start who is really good at early childhood and us was just this natural partnership. One, two, three, jump! Yay! Can you do that again? Jump! <laughs> Between our prairies and our forests and the river and he, even some small man-made ponds at our campus, it's just the perfect site for them to start to engage with nature at a young age and foster those relationships and get them excited about nature, which research shows that if you do that at a young age, especially early childhood, it's gonna lead into behaviors and lifelong love of nature.